Hi, I'm Mandeep Singh, founder of Mandeeps.com and in this video we'll learn how to create a sample site by importing a portal template. So let's get started. One of the first things we want to do is locate our portal template files and those are located in the theme installation files that you downloaded either from DNN store or our site. Now as the name says, the zip file that you downloaded, please make sure you extract that and once you unzip or extract it, you will find a bunch of folders inside it. So this video is specific for DNN 7 and 8 and a uh, few earlier versions of DNN 9. So uh, we're going to be working with this templates folder here. If you have DNN 9.1 or greater installed, this video does not apply to you. There's a separate video on how to do the exp export import process. All right, so let's get started. I have a DNN 8 site here in the background, which I will go ahead and use to create a sample site. So I'm going to take a look at my templates and we are doing an entire site so it's going to be a portal template and this is for a DNN 8 site so I'm looking at that folder in specific. So there's my template file. Now a template file also uh, accompanies a resources files and that is common for both DNN 7 and 8. Okay so what we need to do is move these files to our uh, site. Now normally you would FTP or use a, a FTP client such as FileZilla to connect to your site and upload files or any other tool that you may have. But in my case I have direct access to the files which is right here. So this is my root of my site and I'm going to simply navigate to portals default folder and this is where you move your template files. So I'm going to go ahead and first copy that resources file. And then since I'm running DNN 8, I will go ahead and use this template file. If you were running DNN 7, you would use this one. Simple enough. So this step is done. Now we can go ahead and minimize these and start the import process. Okay, to import a portal template is fairly easy. All you have to do is navigate to admin and then to site wizard. And here's the site wizard which we can use to go ahead and import our portal template. Now if you are running DNN 9.0 uh, something which is not 9.1 or greater then you will not find a site wizard anywhere in your menu. That's not a problem. Since we can go ahead and uh, add an instance of site wizard module to the page. Uh, so let me go ahead and really quick demonstrate that for those who are running earlier versions of DNN 9. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and really quickly switch to a DNN 9 site, which is right here. And as you can see, I've just created a page. Uh, I just called it Site Wizard. You can call it anything you want. Just make sure it's only uh, visible to admins. And then simply add a module to this page. And what we want to do is add the Site Wizard module. So I'm going to simply go ahead and uh, add an instance of this module to the page. And now we have access to the same Site Wizard that we had in DNN 7 and 8. All right, so I'm going to go back to DNN 8 and continue uh, for the rest of the video. All right, so now that we're here from admin, site wizard, we're just simply going to click on next. And, uh, and we're going to now choose uh, that we want to build a site from a template and we want to use our Tahoe uh, want to use our Tahoe template. Uh, you could ignore any of the messages that appear here that varies from installation to installation. It is very important that we choose replace here uh, and how to deal with duplicate modules. And that's it. Hit next. We want to make sure that we choose our uh, theme, the one we're importing the portal template for. So in partic this particular case, I was using Tahoe portal templates. I get, but this video really applies to any theme. Just make sure the theme you're working with, you select that. And usually you want to select the inner template since that's the one that's commonly across to all the inner pages. And I'm going to go ahead and next. And then you want also want to choose a uh, container. So in my case, I'm just going to do uh, maybe an H2 container and I'll use that. And I'll go ahead and hit next. And then finally here you can give it a uh, name of your site, description, keywords and so forth. I'm just going to leave it as it is and hit finish. So now we just patiently wait. The import process uh, can take from a few minutes to several minutes actually depending on the actual hardware configuration of your server. Uh, just patiently wait and if the site does not come back just give it 
5-10 minutes and then try and refresh the page or hit your site again. Uh, usually what happens is this may time out here on the front end but in the back end it's still processing and it's still importing everything in. Now this is a cumbersome process and it's unfortunately an issue with DNN platform which has been resolved in DNN 9.1 or greater and that's why there's a separate way of importing portal templates on DNN 9.1 plus but if you're not running DNN 9.1 plus unfortunately just stick around and wait uh, until the spinning icon goes away and even if it goes away if you don't see the page refreshing you still see this page that means it's not complete you simply want to stick around another 5-10 minutes and then hit your site URL directly or just click on the logo uh, of your site or DNN here and that should bring the page in so that's what we're gonna do I'm gonna go ahead and pause this video for a few minutes and just wait for this to finish okay the site has now refreshed and we have a beautiful sample site created for us as you can see we have all the sample pages created and uh, the site uh, portal template has been imported and we are ready to go and edit the content and start publishing so that's it for the short video thank you so much for watching if you have any questions or concerns feel free to open a support ticket and we'll be happy to assist you